The origins of Chipinonga date back over a thousand years to Saxon England. This is shown by its place name, Chipping being the Saxon word for market and Onga meaning grassland. Positioned on high ground and surrounded by a marsh, Saxon Onga is believed to have been an important marketplace. Archaeologists think it had protective ditches and earthworks for defence against possible invasions by Danes. In the mid 12th century the manor of Onga was held by Richard de Lucy. This powerful nobleman is said to have built Onga Castle. Onga Castle originally consisted of a mot, a high central earth mound and three outer enclosures called baileys. The mot and bailey ramparts were built from clay, gravel and sand dug from around their base. This in turn created a deep ditch. A timber hall, the castle, was built on top of the mot and it is here De Lucy and his family would have lived. Earth and timber castles could be built quickly and cheaply but the wood had a limited life and soon rotted. Stone was often used to replace timber but it is not known if this happened at Onga. The baileys enclosed wooden homes for soldiers and servants and stables and stores associated with the domestic life of the castle. The town enclosure had ramparts and ditches that fully encircled the Norman town. In the 16th century the medieval building on the mound was replaced by a house built by William Morris. It is here Elizabeth I was entertained in 1579. In 1744 this building was pulled down and replaced by a summer house, traces of which remain. Today the castle is a protected ancient monument and is privately owned. However visitors are welcome to walk the footpath which leads from the car park and passes around the inner bailey and the mot. The original buildings of the castle have been lost to time but the impressive earthworks still remain. As you can see despite the passing of 800 years the mot, inner bailey and a section of the town enclosure are well preserved. A full archaeological survey of the site is yet to be undertaken and until such time the castle will continue to guard many of its secrets.